What if I told you that the first animal in history was forgotten by time? Strange, isn't it, huh? We're obsessed with firsts. The first president, the first airplane flight, the first step on the moon, but the first animal? Hardly anyone ever mentions it. That's a little odd. Because the creatures who made their debut on Earth weren't just the beginning of life, they were the beginning of everything. So what was the first creature to walk, crawl, or even swim through the Earth's ancient oceans? Let's take a journey to the distant past, back to when life itself was just a glimmer. If you're ready to discover the origins of it all, then let's get started. The history of life is far older than humanity. When you think of how long humans have existed, it is a mere blink in the grand timeline of life. To understand where animals first appeared, we must go back, way, way back, into a time when Earth looked completely different, when life as we know it was barely a whisper. Fast forward through the ages, from the time dinosaurs ruled the planet over 200 million years ago, to a time even before Pangaea existed. In the grand scheme of things, even the dinosaurs only left a small mark on Earth's history. Let's go even further. To a time before any land animals roamed, before continents were even formed. We're diving into an era known as the Cambrian period, roughly 541 million years ago, when life exploded in diversity. This was the Cambrian explosion, a dramatic burst of new creatures unlike anything before. But even here, we're not talking about the first life forms. This sudden appearance of complex creatures had a foundation, a spark that came earlier. We're traveling back in time, to a time so ancient that the Earth's atmosphere was toxic, the land was barren, and the oceans were completely different. Let's move back to a time that spans a massive 4 billion years, where the eons begin. Eons are the largest measure of time in geology, so get ready for a deep dive. The first signs of life on Earth appeared during the Archean Eon, around 3.7 billion years ago though we can only guess at their appearance. Scientists believe these first life forms were likely bacteria thriving near underwater vents. These early organisms left behind some of the oldest evidence of life, cyanobacteria, also known as blue-green algae. While these tiny microbes didn't resemble the animals we know today, they set the stage for everything that followed. These bacteria were responsible for one of Earth's greatest transformations they began producing oxygen, which eventually made Earth's atmosphere breathable for more complex life. However, it wasn't until the Proterozoic Aeon, long after cyanobacteria, that the first true animals began to evolve. In this time, Earth's atmosphere had changed, and oxygen began to fill the air, allowing more complex organisms to appear. And in the frigid waters of a world locked in ice, life began to take its first steps. Behold the first true animals, the sponges. These primitive creatures were simple but essential in the grand scheme of life's progression. Still, life on Earth would need more time to evolve into something we'd recognize. It wasn't until the Idiocran period that life began to evolve in more diverse and complex ways. In the warm, shallow seas of this period, the first animals with more distinct shapes and forms appeared. Albeit still simple in structure, many of these early creatures were stationary, like the bizarre pancake-like Dickinsonia, or other planet-like creatures that had no hard bodies to protect them. Yes, these early organisms set the blueprint for the future. Some of the very first animals to evolve into mobile creatures included a segmented war like Sprigina and Kimberella, the earliest known bottom feeders. These early creatures started to develop the basic body plan, a head at one end, a body that mirrored the symmetry we see in most animals today. Interestingly, some of the ancient creatures we see today are direct descendants of these first animals. The jellyfish, for an example, has remained relatively unchanged for millions of years. Life in the oceans was already rich with worms, sponges, and primitive sea anemones, creatures that still persist in some form today. So while the first animals may not have been the flashy creatures we might have imagined, their legacy lives on in the world around us. 
the creatures that emerged from the depths of Earth's early oceans were the blueprints for all life that followed. Thank you for joining us through this incredible journey. If you've learned something new, hit that like button. And if you're an expert in ancient life, feel free to drop all your insights in the comments below. Until next time, stay curious and keep exploring the wonders of our planet's deep history.